I guess we're going to go eat some cheeseburgers. Hey everyone, Dev here, and today it's bright out. I'm in Caseville, and we are here for the Cheeseburger Festival. We're gonna go eat some cheeseburgers. I don't know how many we're gonna eat because I don't know how many cheeseburgers you can eat in one sitting, but it seemed like a pretty interesting festival, so we came here and checked it out. I see a lot of people rolling around in golf carts dressed up in island attire. What? They got Dole Whip? Well, alrighty, we got into the main event where most of the burger joints are. The one I wanted to try was Crab and Shack. They have a deep fried cheeseburger here. And they have the Hawaiian burger that I wanted to get. He wants the, he, 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 he wants the Hawaiian So what do you say was on? It's um, the cornbread. Corn, it's cornmeal. Look at that. There's track. That is good. A little different because it's got brown gravy on it. Brown gravy, pineapple, mango, ham, cheese. And it came with an edible flour. Back. The deep fried burger. The deep fried burger. It's a double patty burger. Ketchup. That's pretty good. I have to say that Hawaiian burger was probably my favorite. The deep fried burger comes in at a close second. Now we're gonna head over to this fried food and get like fried lime, key lime pie, and uh, pecan pie, and other fried food. We got key lime pie, Ew. pecan pie. And pineapple and Oreos. Hey, why is that liquidy? The first so? key lime pie. No. It's like it's not popcorn or something else. Oh. Hey, that's sour. Next up, pecan pie. That was pretty good. Let's do it. You can try this one. Then we can recut one. Tastes like key lime. Next up, some pineapple. Exactly right. Tastes like key lime. That one is really good. It's hot. It's like a pineapple so cinnamon donut. It's like pretty darn good. Classic Oreos. Look at that. That's a cheesecake. That's not Nothing beats. There's no pecan. Deep fried Oreos. I do gotta say, all those fried foods were really good. I think the pineapple, probably my favorite, because I'm not the biggest key lime pie fan. Now, since we after we ate a lot of food, we're gonna go try to walk it off, because there's a couple other burgers I wanted to try here. See, this festival goes on for miles. We even got a burger joint down the road from where we just were. There's nothing that says burning off burgers like taking a quick walk on the beach over here in Caseville. You know Caseville is like one of the cities I haven't been to yet. Let me know down in the comments if there's any other cities that have wacky festivals like Cheeseburger Festival that I should visit. Welcome to the tip of the fun.
Okay, enough of the beach. Back to the cheeseburger business. We found another spot we're gonna. This probably be the last cheeseburger we get of the day. Cheeseburgers are quite filling. Oh, and they were the winner of 2021. Well, already I got burger number three here, and this is called the Rum Runner Stunner. This is actually that place is 2022 entry for the burger contest. It's got pineapple, so I'm sensing a theme because I love pineapple on my burgers. Oh, that's a good burger. Green car right there. We conquered three burgers. I recommend if you come to a festival like this, I recommend you bring more people and you split the burgers. We drove down the road a little ways and we came to a place that you guys have only seen on my channel in the winter time. We are here in Port Austin. We're actually going on the boardwalk they have all the way out across the lake. Wow, look at that view right there. It's crazy. You can see the clouds, how they change. That's actually a storm. And then it's all clear that way. Now there is a rock around here, like a rock formation. Kind of like pictured rocks, but it's called turnip rock. I believe it's over there. Really cool one day to go in there. Kayak and film that. This is giving me straight up Florida vibes. Like we're back in Florida again. Ah, it's Michigan. There's no there's no sharks in there. No sharks whatsoever. It'd be crazy if they found that Michigan had freshwater sharks and we just like discovered them. I don't know if I'd go swimming in the Great Lakes ever again. Turnip Rock is that way somewhere. Closely you can actually see the rain falling right there. I don't know if you can see it on camera, but you can kind of see it from where we are. That's cool. I think that's going to do it for today, guys. It's a great place to end up and vlog. If you guys like this video, please give it a thumbs up. And if you're new here, remember to subscribe. And with that being said, guys, get your foot out the door and explore because adventure awaits. I'll see you guys tomorrow. I go digest these cheeseburgers.